lately, I discovered a wonderful local business startup this week. Tell me about it. I'm so excited about these guys. They are incredible. Their idea is just phenomenal. They are called HOLD, which stands for Hearing Out Life's Drama. And they are an online, so you can do a Zoom, um, a phone, or a text appointment with them. And they're basically something in between or a little bit different than as well, a therapist and a friend. Because with a therapist, you're doing a lot of therapy. You're doing a lot of work. Um, With Hold, what you're doing is they are called listeners. And so you are actually kind of just unloading like you would with therapy. But a lot of times we don't necessarily need that level of care. A lot of times we just need somebody to talk to. Right. So this is that. And it's they are fantastic. They actually gave me a complimentary dry run so that I could test it out and talk about it today. So sweet. That is really cool. And and that I think that's really true, especially nowadays, um, post, uh, you know, the last couple of years. Um, You know, people don't necessarily need, you know, heavy duty therapy of, you know, tell me about your mother and going back decades and digging up deep root issues and all this stuff. Some people are just, you know, have been out of the loop for a little while and, and just, just need some guidance. Just need somebody to, to shoot the crap yeah, with. Yeah, or talk to. Yeah, I, I guess I shouldn't have said guidance because really it is. You can ask for it. You can ask yeah, for their advice Yeah, some people do need like just to. a little advice, a yeah. little bit of guidance, a little bit of mm-hmm. bouncing some ideas off of other people. But some people just need to have a freaking conversation. Yeah, and with somebody who you know is not going to go ahead and then have that information stored and use it not use it per se. I'm not, I'm not saying that everybody will do that, but just because they already know. But not have it in their like, sphere around yeah. you all the time. It's somebody, you know, a dis, quote unquote disinterested third party. Yes. If you're having an argument with your significant other, for example, that it, that doesn't necessarily require therapy. It doesn't. And talking to your friends about it is only going to make them, you know, be like, Ugh, that jerk next time they see him. So the best way There's to no take judgment. care of that would it's, be to call hold. Yeah. It's yeah. completely judgment free because they don't have any prior information right. to lay on the situation. They won't have any after information to lay on the situation. It's just a point in time where you, you know, exchange some information mm-hmm. and that's the end of it. Exactly. You know, that's that's an awesome idea. Oh, it was so fabulous. And I did, I, on purpose, I did their 15-minute um, version because I thought, okay, this will really put them to the test. Mm-hmm. <laughs> see how that works. See if it's something that actually really, truly does benefit me. Mm-hmm. So um, I actually got to do that this morning, and it was just fabulous. I couldn't believe it. It was it was over something that it's not going to be something to take to therapy. It's not an argument with anybody. It's just a situation that I'm dealing with with a specific family member, mm-hmm. a distant family member, and I wanted to just get it off my chest and just talk about it. And it was amazing. And, and then, because she was so good at listening. I don't know how I did it, but I got like me, Eden, Mm -hmm. I got it out in 10 minutes. Wow. (laughs) And so I still had five minutes left. And so I asked her, I said, do you have any advice? I know that that was just a whole huge situation to unload on you, but do you have any advice? And she just said the most marvelous thing. And it, it, it is basically a comprises all the other wisdom kind of put together, you know, you don't really want to hear all the altruistic stuff that you hear a lot, like everything happens for a reason. Right. Or, you know, this too shall pass. Right. Yeah. You know, those kind of get old after like five or six hundred And you already know all that. Yeah, you do. And, And it's, yeah, it's not exactly that comforting. But in this case, what she said was, you know, that no matter what this person chooses, no matter which direction they take, that it's right Mm -hmm. because that's their journey and who are we to know and i was just like right this i'm a shaman right (laughs) but when it's your situation Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. oh yeah the the there's a fog there Mm -hmm. yes yep and it was just so relieving and so sweet and it i don't know how to explain it but the lack of credentials uh-huh. made it less pressure for sure. me somehow. Sure. Isn't that yeah, interesting? Yeah, not having that old alphabet of, oh, of yeah. 
you know, letters after her name, mm -hmm. you know, or whatever. So hearingoutlifedrama.com, go to hearingoutlifedrama.com and hearingoutlifedrama.com mm -hmm. and they can set it up as a phone consultation or as in a zoom or a zoom or uh -huh. there's multiple or text. different uh -huh. or and text. they have tons of hours available that's incredible well we are done with segment one of reno spark